In this tutorial, we will go over downloading and using the OverDrive app. OverDrive is a free service provided by Maryville University that allows you to download ebooks and audiobooks to your device. This app is available through all major app stores, including the Apple App Store, Google Play, and the Windows Store. In this video, we'll introduce you to the OverDrive app using an Apple device. Let's go ahead and download this app to your device now. If you've used OverDrive before, you can just select Sign In. To sign into the app, if you are a new user, select Sign Up instead. You can sign up with OverDrive with your Maryville ID number or your Maryville email address. Since I already am a user of OverDrive, I'm going to go ahead and sign in. I'll select Sign In using a library card, and then I will type in Maryville. Under Mobius Consortium, select Maryville University. And then I'll again select my library from the list below. This is where I'll need to put in my user ID for the first time. You want to make sure that you include the 10 digit number of your ID number, followed by a lowercase m at the end. Here's an example. Once you sign in, you'll then need to add a library again. You'll click to add a title, and then it will take you to Mobius. This is where you're going to need to sign in for the second time. Again, you're going to want to select your library, and then put in your user ID once more. From here, you can now download and add titles to your app bookshelf. This includes ebooks or audiobooks. When you find a book you like, you're just going to select Borrow at the bottom and it can allow you to choose how many days you'd like to borrow for. When you select Borrow, make sure that you click Download EPUB eBook. This will allow you to download the book to your app. Downloading titles to the app bookstore makes it easier to read or listen to them when you're not connected to the internet. You can find your bookstore at the top left-hand corner. You'll select Bookshelf, and you'll see some of the books that have already been downloaded. Downloaded titles appear in the app bookshelf and all you have to do is tap the title to get started. All titles automatically expire and are returned to the library at the end of a lending period. There are lots of other things you can do with the OverDrive app. For instance, you can change the brightness. You can also change the contrast lighting as well. In addition to that, you can also change the font size if you'd like something smaller or larger. And you can even change the font style as well to something that's more specific to your liking. To learn about the OverDrive app, you can also visit the help section available in this app, again on the left hand side. This will allow you to find more information, including instructions about the particular device that you have. If you have any questions, please ask a librarian. We can help you with any of these questions, whether it's online or if you come in person to the library. Good luck and read on.